Right, well, guys, welcome back to another episode. We've um, planned a little trip to head over to Scorefell Island. It's been beautiful weather all week, and now it's not. It's gonna get worse. It's gonna get worse. We've got a little bit of a window there to head over, and um, there's just the three of us Lockie, Nobby, myself, and we're gonna head to Scorefell Island for the night, camp there, and then hopefully the weather drops off in the morning and we're going straight to the reef. I'm super excited about this one because this will be the first time, or actually the furthest I've ever been out in the boat. So, see how we go. Don't kill me. Let's get it. <laughs> also, it's my fucking birthday. So, how you going? Choo! So, we're going to have a few drinks so hopefully we don't get too wild and, um, I don't know, we're just going to play around, see what happens. If we can go fishing this afternoon, we definitely will. If not, well, we're just going to head straight to Scorefield and um, have a few drinks. That's about it. Right, right, check back in then. Yo! So the weather is absolutely shit house. Beautiful, bloody beautiful. Gorgeous sunny day. Right, we're gonna get a nice bandit on the way over. <laughs> we're, we're fucking getting the dogs, that's definitely right. Fuck now, look at them. Wet the dogs. Hold on, I'm trying to show you the con like the contrast of what's going on here. The waves are fair decent. Would you say it's glassed out, Nobby? It's pretty glassed out. Yeah, it's glassed out. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa. Gets the worm, but <laughs> <laughs> and we'd want to catch something. <laughs> I laugh in the face of danger. <laughs> we made it. <laughs> Boy, how was the trip over? Mate, I've definitely seen better days. <laughs> seen better days. It was the wildest trip over. I can tell you that right now. At least two meter swells. It was absolutely terrible. It's taken us like three hours to get to Scorefeld. And we're not, we're definitely not disappointed with where we are. Can tell you that right now. But wow, it was an amazing trip over. It was super exciting. We're just having a sus. We're gonna set up later. We're wait, oh, what are we waiting on? For Waiting for the tide to go out a little bit. We're going to camp in the bay. You guys will see it. I'll throw up the drone shots. A bit rough. Anyway, Scorefield Island is quite the paradise. I've never actually camped on here. I've come here once with Nobby and his granddad and cooked up a bit of a feed where we were. Anyway, Scorefield Island, it is an absolute paradise machine. And here we are. The whole crew. On the left, you will see Scofell Island. On the, left, On the right, Scofell you see Island. Pacific So, we've rocked up to camp and... What do you reckon, Lockie? Reckon we got a winner. We have got the whole beach to ourselves. We're gonna put the boat up. Well, the boat's getting anchored. We're setting up camp, Scorefell Island. They've got a little hut, little rainwater tank, and they've got a long drop. So, Comfort. We're, we're getting spoiled, to be honest. Anyway, we are going to wait until the morning and hopefully the morning will bring us good weather. That's what we're hoping for or it's going to be another terrible day and a terrible episode probably.
What a morning it's been. So, we got up at like four o'clock in the morning and we had to beat the tide of getting the boat out from Schoolfeld Island. So, we, when we started heading out, it was absolute shit house conditions. So, we've managed to sneak behind Calder Island and we've had a bit of a fish in the morning. Nothing crazy has really happened this morning. Uh, we did see a couple of whales and sharks busting up the waters, but um, yeah, we haven't really. Uh, it's been quite the chill morning, to be honest. And um, I just missed a big jack. Did ya? Oh, it's been kind of a bit chill morning, but we've pulled up. The boys are going in for a bit of a spearfish. I'm chilling on the boat. I'm going to get some drone shots and put a line in, see what happens. But yeah, I am tempted to put the drone up, but. There's this little eagle that's sitting in the, you can hear him squawking, he's sitting up in the mountains or up on this cliff face here and um, I don't know if you can hear that but it just sounds like he's hungry and he wants to eat my drone so I might have to watch it <laughs> but I don't know, this camera doesn't do justice to these cliff faces here they are like 20 meters, 30 meters in the air. Just absolutely breathtaking. And it just goes all along. Tally's slowly coming up. We got two trout and a tusky with a wild looking head on it. At least we're not going home empty handed. That's um, probably the best thing. <laughs> oh well. Hopefully you've paid the sea tax, mate, and um, more to come. Fingers crossed. <laughs> Nobody just keeps going too far. Look at him. I'm trying to catch up to him, but every time I get closer and I'm near a fish and I forget. <laughs> I probably should go over near him, eh? Yeah, I'll jump back in and start doing that.
gonna turn off the camera. Catch myself a fish. I'm just gonna grab him if he'll let me. Oh, he's got some spikes at the back. Look at that one. Nice. So as I'm watching this eagle, I'm watching the boys, they're on, on that point over there. And I'm thinking that the eagle is swooping their bait because he keeps going near where they are and swooping the boys in the water. Like I wish I had a better lens because that bird on that thing is huge. I think Nobby's got another camera with another lens and we're gonna try and set it up and get it going. Awesome. It's insane, but I find it funny that the guys have to like already have to worry about sharks in the water. But now like first hand I'm seeing an eagle try and sweep them as well. It's like they're not safe. This is insane. I'm hoping I'm trying my best. Every time I get a still shot, the boat moves and I can't I can't get a try and snap a shot of him. I think I got one. It's pretty exciting actually. So definitely not too disappointed with the uh, haul. Not bad for a couple of hours diving. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, look at all the fish that I caught. Yeah. <laughs> look at them. Right everyone, that is it for another episode. Man, what an epic adventure. I have it's like been awesome the whole time the way out was absolutely terrible but we knocked back a few tinnies and that kind of made it a little bit better and what a way to spend my birthday i am pretty stoked pretty stoked don't forget to subscribe to the channel guys come on you gotta do it you're watching it and then make sure you follow me on instagram make sure you follow me on facebook as well and keep up with the adventure guys